Okay, this video is how to uh, get a PlayStation 3 remote to run on Mach 3. And anyway, the first thing to do is to open up your Mach 3 folder. Hope you guys can see that. Anyway, and you want to go to a program called Key Grabber. And in there, um, first you also need to load the driver for your. Uh, find your controller for Windows. <clears throat> I already have most of this set up but if you go to HID controllers if your driver is selected you should see this uh, PSR and you want to click yes and so then that will show up. Then if you go to the HID keys um, each key on the controller is definable in here and it's really easy to do if you just push a key it will automatically light up that key now you can see that I already have it uh, saved but if you want to change it you just click inside this box under translate to double click it and I'll ask you to s select a, a key then I push the corresponding key on the keyboard and I'll automatically record it. Being that I have this set, I'll just ignore it and hit cancel. Um, you can also go to joysticks and you can select the little joysticks to do whatever you want. Um, X-axis, Y-axis. Um, you just push that one, it'll tell you what axis it is. And then you go in the controls here in the drop down and select uh, what axis you want to move. Uh, when you're done, go to file, save config and then go down here start mock 3 I'll go to my profile here and show you how it works um, while this is loading if you google um, if you google uh, mock 3 keyboard shortcuts it'll come up with a wiki here with all the standard hotkeys so if you don't know what all the keys do on your keyboard you can look them up over here and it will tell you um, what it controls. And we'll go back here. We'll undo the e stop on my machine and I will show you how it works. All right. Um, I have it so I can start the spindle on one. So there we go. Um, start, stop. Um, I can. Raise the spindle, lower. Let me see if I can set this down here and so you can watch all what it's doing. Um, left, right. And then you can even joggle this. Although my little pad here is going opposite of what, uh, of what I want it to, I'm not sure if I can change that yet or not. Um, but the the actual joysticks here are uh, linear so you can actually go slow or fast depending on how how fast you push the uh, the joystick back and forth um, I have this button set up as my cycle start I got the round one here as my cycle stop and uh, I can raise and lower the feed rate on it um, it's pretty awesome I think I paid about uh, 12 bucks for this uh, remote control Anyway, I know there's ones out there for uh, the Xbox 360, but those controllers are a lot more expensive than the PlayStation 3. But uh, anyway, that's it.